I'm Alexis. I'm Michaela. And, and we, we are, are AM Baking. Today we're making a birthday cake for my dad. Texas shaped cake. Texas Rangers. We're using a box cake because we're going to be lazy today. And we are short on time. We're also using some blue food coloring, some red food coloring, some food writer markers if we need it, not really sure yet, some white on it. And if we're feeling real spicy towards the end, we're gonna use some color mist shimmering food color spray in gold. This is the paint we're using. We're just gonna make it in a nine by 13 and then we'll put this on it and then cut it out. Yes. Might get two depending on the size. So for this box mix, you need one cup of water, half a cup of vegetable oil and three white eggs or three whole eggs. So currently we have the oven on to 350, 350 as it says. Mix it all together, you know how to make cake basically. We're just gonna go white because we're really trying to focus on the design aspect of this. <laughs> I'm mixing with a whisk, I prefer whisks. Most people use this bed. We just got this fondant from Walmart. I'm pretty sure it's the same, yeah, it's Wilton. Same as these food coverings, and I think this is also real cool. Yes, it is. Sponsor us. All of our stuff is yours. We're ready. If you have a cake mix, Wilton, then you want to send it to us, and we'll use it in the video. There you go. Obviously, mix it until there are no more lumps. And then I'm just spraying nonstick spray. We are also going to insert a picture of the cake that oh. we're doing. by 13 bake for 29 to 34 minutes but we have a convection oven so it's probably not going to take as long it tastes like gum to me that dissolves which is disgusting i think it's good cakes over cake any day bro amen sticks of butter on low medium until it's one Alright, now that the butter's whipped, I'm gonna add four cups of powdered sugar. An eighth of a teaspoon of salt, which I'm eyeballing it as basically just a pinch. And then a fourth teaspoon of almond extract. Use it, trust me, it's the best. Two teaspoons of vanilla. And then a third cup heavy cream. This is the red we'll be using. If you didn't know the colors of the Texas Rangers, it, it's red and blue. Like, and I really white. honestly don't know. We're not 100% sure. This is what the cake looks like. If it's not, then it's gonna be a little embarrassing. Oh, this is the blue that we're using. We're using these to trace the Texas. We also just printed oh, yes. off. You couldn't tell from the beginning. We just printed off a Texas shape. I'm going to use a toothpick to dip it into the food coloring to dye the fondant. You're just going to make it round like this. Like and this is a little too thick, so we're going to cut it, I think. Next, we're gonna do the red. So basically, this is what I did. I just used a toothpick to dip it in there, and then I put some on there. And I'm gonna like knead it out. This is definitely gonna dry my hands. Then, as you can see, because nobody wants to eat that thick fondant. And I rolled these little pieces. If you know what a baseball looks like, then you'll see my thickening. So that's gonna be that piece, and then that one's gonna go there. And then I made little smaller ones that are gonna be kind of like V-shaped when I put them on there are going to look like the stitches and how you put fondant together is you basically just if you have a brush you just paint it on there with water or you can use your finger but it's gonna look like that all the way down for baseball okay. 
Now she's gonna flip it. Can you flip why? Yeah, why? Oh, because this card's prettier and it's easier for us. There you go. What if I throw this? Yeah. Basically, she's just tracing it out. before this is very satisfying that is what it would be i don't think it's too bad yeah, it's fine but i'm gonna throw it in the fridge but if, i'm gonna freeze it i think really this one should be on top i mean it, wait i guess okay. it's not gonna matter wait you need a frost oh yeah mm -hmm. is that it? <laughs> i put a little bit right more right there oh wait you want to report it i feel like it would have looked better one layer because then I could have really done this better. Yeah, maybe we should have frosted one because it's going to be frosted true. anyways. That's true. It's okay. We want it dope. and that's what it looks like that's after frosting and she's gonna go with the outline with white too. well thank you for watching that's the end of our video i will insert a picture of our product next to what we were achieving for we ended up not going with the rangers writing considering we're still pretty new and we did not like the outline of it <laughs> Thanks for watching. And remember, we, we do, do the, the baking, baking so you don't have to. A masterpiece. But we gotta be careful. I'm driving. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, that's why you don't pick up other people's gum. I mean, obviously. Not <laughs> why are you making people's gum? Off? Oh, that's so good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Real creative, on. What are you laughing at? <laughs> no, it's for the pig. What? <laughs> you did not eat all of <laughs> I was like, how uh, long on the cake? Ah! Oh, it was a fly. <laughs> One, it's in here. back there. Where? It's over there now. Good. Big. See? It's huge. Oh, my word, I <laughs> knew you were going to do that. What? I made a SpongeBob reference, but I'm pretty sure you didn't oh, watch no. SpongeBob. But I guess Shelter. If we didn't watch SpongeBob, you did not have a childhood. I just don't like SpongeBob in general. <laughs> what?